What's up, everybody? So we got the fine. Well, like the final issue of this kind of run. We're ten issues in. The art kind of took a little bit of a dip, but this is really the end of the kind of multi-sect dimension hopping arc. And uh, the ending, I don't know. I guess it makes more sense in context with the recent Fantastic Four book. But you you don't need to read that. You could have kept going with this. But we finally know what happens and how they get their powers back. So if you remember in the last issue, Susan Storm showed up. And that started giving them their powers back. And it turns out it was Susan Storm. We find out here. She talks about them and finds that they got their signals. So they did hear it. And we also found out that their powers were gone too. And that's why Reed put it together that they needed to get their powers back as well. And it looks like her going to see them jump-started everyone's powers they don't really kind of explain it that much, but, you know, comics, right? Anyway, they get their powers back, and the fake Fantastic Four that the uh, Thinker made up using that woman's uh, superpower machine, that machine that can give you powers, I don't know if they're going to ever bring her back. Uh, we'll see. That's really kind of a uh, plot hole right now. Where is she at? And where is Dr. Doom? Because Dr. Doom chased after her. And she doesn't come back in this issue. So we'll see what happens. And I'm going to have some theories on what's going to happen. And I'll get to that in a second. But pretty much Human Torch and the thing beat the crap out of all four of the fake Fantastic Four that showed up in the last issue. And that's really it. It's just them kicking ass and... We get a little bit of a resolution towards the end where they go home. They've got a multi-sec. They took the thinkers, and you see them here. They go back home, and that's it. They're going to go back home and wait. They still don't know that Susan Storm is alive, though, because they think that maybe they're just dreaming and their powers just came back, which doesn't make sense. You think they would think, you know, how did our powers just redevelop and come back out of nowhere? So it's a little weird, a little weird for that. Feels like a rushed ending in some ways. It really does. I think, um, honestly, this series could have gone another couple of months and really just had a really great epic ending. That's how it should have went. It should have, it should have went for another six months. A lot of buildup. You know, them kind of managing their power use. Dr. Doom could have stayed on. They would eventually have found the Fantastic Four and went home. And then it could have led right into Fantastic Four number one. That would have been a perfect. That would have been a perfect. That would have been a perfect run. The way this one ended is kind of weak. I'm going to be honest. But it was still fine. The whole, the whole review, the whole, I mean the whole run, all ten issues. While the art kind of took some dips, especially at the end. Um... The story stayed good. Once again, like cementing how good Chip Zdarsky is in his writing. Um, you can say what you want about the guy. The guy can write a good story. This has probably been one of the better, like, man, I don't think since, like, Planet Hulk, there's been a good event like this was. This was great. Um, I don't know if it's going to keep going. So you see the next issue says uh, it's, it's going to be Mr. Fantastic and the Thing. So, you know, back in the day, in the original Marvel 201, it used to be the thing teaming up with somebody all the time. So I'm wondering if they're going to keep that narrative and now have it be the thing and somebody else. I think that would be kind of cool. As long as Zadarsky keeps writing it, I'll keep reading it. Because uh, so far it's been really good. But, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. I'm hoping, uh, you know, we get some more maybe... Uh, I'd like to find out what happened to Dr. Doom. I wonder if they're going to tie that up in the next one. Maybe they're going to look for him. We'll see. We'll see. Anyway, that's about it. Uh, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this run. What do you think about it? How do you think it should have ended? Do you agree with me? Do you disagree? Also, uh, throw a like up. Subscribe. Maybe hit that notification bell if you so would be so kind. And that's pretty much it. See you guys on the next one. Peace.